Well, hello. How are you? I am good. I'm tired. It's been a long day. I'm actually filming later than I usually do. <laughs> I usually film in the morning, but my um, our son broke his toe <laughs> the other day um, in weight weightlifting. Anyway, long story. <laughs> but... Um, he broke his toe, so we had his orthopedic appointment today to see what needed to be done. So, um, he also had minimum day at school, and so it was just a lot of, like, my husband and I took him to school, but we kind of stayed close to the school because it's a little far, and, um, picked him up and straight to the appointment, and, oh, he has to have surgery on, uh, yeah, he has to have surgery next week, so on a spring break. So, yay. Mm, poor baby. But it'll be okay. So, um, came home and I'm just so behind. I have so many Timu packages to open. I have this one. I have this one came today and it's heavy and there's like, I think four or five, five different orders in that bag. Like, can you stop putting all the orders together, please? <laughs> and then I've got this one. And then I have some little ones. Oh, at least my address was covered. This, I just, I can't. There's just, hmm. So I don't usually, um, I haven't usually been posting on Fridays because on Saturday is when I have the junk journal series. If you haven't seen it and you're new here, hi, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. I'm so happy that you have decided to join our little family. I'm a ding dong. And yeah, I have a journal series that I do. And um, so every, a junk journal series, I should say, every Saturday. And I just kind of go through making a junk journal from scratch and using things that you have at home. Usually, um, if you're a crafter, you probably have all kinds of other supplies like stamps and inks and paints and all that fun stuff. So, um, join on in cause you'll have a lot of fun. If you're not a crafter and you would like to give it a try, you really don't need a whole heck of a lot. Um, there's things that you can use in place of certain things. And I kind of talk about a little bit of that. I'm not an expert in any way, shape or form. <laughs> I am, I feel like I'm still a novice. Um, I do it because it, it's relaxing for me and I love to give handmade gifts and it's a fun thing to give to somebody. In my opinion, it can be super, super personalized and just kind of tailored to that person, you know, and then they know like how much thought and care was put into their gift and it's special. So I love to do it. And, uh, when I learned how to do it, I was fascinated and I just want to share my journey and how I learned how to do it and the things that I do. But yeah, if you've got, you know, <laughs> macaroni and cheese box, use it. You can make that the cover. Um, I used, in this series, <laughs> I used a fish stick box. <laughs> and we use junk mail and junk mail envelopes and obviously remove any personal information. Um, most everything gets covered, but just on the safe side, you know. Don't use anything personal. Um, but yeah, you just... You use all these things and extra papers and notebook paper and anything, I, anything. I'm, I'm not going to go over all of it. But anyway, so I have that series on Saturdays. So I don't usually film on Friday because I'm very busy crafting and filming for Saturday. Because if I try to do it Saturday morning, the video takes so long to get on. Like I have to edit it and those are so long. They're so long, so <laughs> it takes hours, <laughs> hours to just film and edit and everything. And then on top of that, you've got YouTube that takes hours to 
upload and process and do all the checks and everything. So, anywho, I'm I'm filming today because I have packages that I need to open, and um, uh, I'm just gonna craft tonight and film at night. I don't usually do that. I usually film in the morning. It's when I'm feeling the most chipper. Have my coffee. <laughs> Everyone's out of the house. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, anyway, so yeah, that's why I'm here tonight. And uh, it might be a little bit late. And that's because I'm filming really late. And I got to edit it and then um, upload it. But you'll have to... You don't have to do nothing. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> I'm tired, okay? Tell me how your day went. That's what I was going to say. You have to tell me how your day went. I'm really not used to posting, like, filming this late. It's crazy. Okay, so we're going to open this little package, but I believe sometimes little packages can have a lot of stuff. So let's go through it. Ain't nothing to it, but just to do it. Ooh, ooh. Okay. First things first. And if you're new here, um, I like to put the prices down in the corner. Um, and then I usually will link to everything in the comment or in the description box below. Um, yeah. Okay. So um, my returning subscribers will know. <laughs> I, I'm i just so tired. I'm so sorry. My returning subscribers will know that... Um, I like to sleep with a bonnet because it helps the frizz stay to a minimum and it keeps your hair soft. It doesn't strangle me in the middle of the night because that's happened. It's the worst. You're waking up, you're like, oh, oh, you know? No, I don't like that. It's the worst feeling. So, anyway, I have a couple bonnets, um, but I never. Uh, I'm trying to think. I think both of the bonnets that I have, I got at Walmart. <laughs> and they're great. I love them. But um, I did order, I think, a bonnet once from Timu. And it was a Thai one. I like the elastic better. But the Thai one that I got, it was, it was a beautiful one. It's so pretty. But the Thai, I can't. I can't do it. I don't like it. It, it gets in my way. Uh, it's a sensory thing, I think. I'm very sensitive to things like that. Um, I just couldn't, whether it was tied here on the side, which you can't tie it on the side if you're a side sleeper because then you got that lump mm -mm. Um, in the back. It's just, I couldn't. I couldn't do it. So I don't wear it. <laughs> and I get frustrated because I like to keep, you know, wash them and stuff. So I like to entertain, entertain them. Anyway, I got some more bonnets. So you're going to see several because I think I've ordered like three, maybe four. Okay. Anyway, this is one. Isn't she pretty? <laughs> She's so pretty. But usually, you know, my hair, I put it like in a makeshift, make, really? make shift bun usually before I put the bonnet on but you can just do it like that just to get it in there so it's easy and then I just tuck my hair in and most of the time I will um I'm sure y'all know how why am I showing you how to put on a bonnet I don't know maybe so you can see just what I do but God, this ear is still so sore I'm still wearing my my fit, my flower earrings that Aaron got me. They're so cute. Um, and they're so lightweight and stuff. They're comfy. But yeah, so I usually, when I sleep at night, sorry, it's, it's folded under. I like to put the bonnet over my ear where the earrings are because it kind of holds them in place. Um, but only on certain earrings because of the back if they're too big. But yeah, there we go. I don't know why I was so particular. I'm not going to bed. <laughs> this is what I look like every night when I go to bed. <laughs> so, hair bonnet. Love it. Very excited about it. Another hair bonnet. Okay. You know, um, there is... A new hauler on the scene. I mean, 
just laughing because I was thinking about his video. And uh, he's posted two videos so far. And I believe his channel name is Smile Until It Hurts. And Lord, he makes me smile. I laugh and laugh and laugh. Um, <clears throat> he puts on like a whole show. It's not like your normal haul. I'm not a normal mom. I'm a cool mom, you know? <laughs> But he does a whole show, full on. Like, like, I can't even, I can't even explain it. It's just very creative, you know? And I ended up on the first video that I watched of his, I ended up going and purchasing like three of the things that he talked about. Nice. And I laughed and I'm still laughing after watching the second video and but, um, honestly, it's just so fun. Like, he's got props and all. Like, come on. You want some, uh, theater with your haul? Go check out Smile Until It Hearts. <laughs> Tell him Gigi sent you with a little, well, hello. Oh, that's another thing. In the first video, he shouts out, like, a ton of haulers, right? And he puts on, like, a little skit for each one. Just saying. He's funny. Okay. Just a little teal one. I'm not going to do the whole shebang again, but here we go. Looks like a mushroom. But I love the color teal. Now, I will say, these are thinner than the ones that I get from Walmart. Will that play a role in the hair? I don't know. I'll let you know if you're interested. Okay. Oh, my gosh. This is so tiny. Um... This is, if the picture, where's the picture? There it is. Um, it looks like the hair oil applicator. Now, I had seen this on a couple ch channels. <laughs> um, but uh, the one I remember right now is Crazy Mimi Yep. If you haven't seen her, go check her out. She's very cute. Her husband's in the background helping her out, you know, like giving her all the goodies and stuff but I saw her haul this and I had seen it on Timu and I thought about it but I was like mm, I don't know but then I was interested <laughs> after seeing her so I guess you put the scalp oil or whatever in there the treatment that you're going to use and it has that little top and I guess you just put it on your hair like that and just kind of can you see? You know? I don't know. I'm assuming that's what you do. <laughs> nice. So it won't leak. That's really good. So make sure you put the... The ones that would leak. Which are which ones? I don't even know. Maybe the metal ones? Yeah, I'm sure it's the metal ones that go in there. What is wrong with you, Gigi? Use a brain. Use some of the brain cells. Okay. Just a few. Just need a few. Oh, yeah, I'm just trying to get everything kind of situated and filmed before my daughter and grandkids get home. Um, they've moved back in for a little while, and I get to enjoy my grandbabies. So I like to not have anything to do before they go to bed, so that way I can see them and play with them a bit. So, but I really wanted to get on here. Like, really, really wanted to get on here. Um, get through some of these bags. I got some dry erase markers because in um, a recent haul, I got a large magnet um, weekly planner thing. And you can put it on the fridge or whatever. And it has space to, like, write so many things for the week rather than a calendar. And I believe I got fine point. Let me see. Oh, my little portable dry erase board's all the way over there. Check that out, purple. They got the little eraser on the top. Little magnet to stick on the fridge. Okay, so yeah, it is a... I don't know if I would say fine point. I don't know if, if I purchase it thinking fine point. Bullet one to two millimeter. I 
Okay. I gotta erase some stuff. I was doing some die cutting today. Um, in preparation for another episode. Not tomorrow's. Um, but for another one. I want to actually review every single die cut that I've purchased off of Timu for you. Um, I've gotten quite a bit. I didn't even make a dent in the pile of die cuts that I have. But it's great to go through them all. Okay. Let's see. Oh, it is. It writes very nice. You see it? There we go. <laughs> I should have made it a bunny. I should be going through my haul stuff. There, it's a bunny. <laughs> oh my god, I'm sorry. Okay. Well, they work nice. Okay, that's good. I wanted ones that would be easy to write for the planner for the week, you know. So it's not too fat. <clears throat> I mean, it's pretty fine point. Ooh. If you saw a recent haul of mine, you will know that I purchased these um, little sleeve, like, arm covers. I don't remember what color I got before, but I said I loved them and I was going to get more. Well, I did. <laughs> got these, and this is supposedly like their skin tone one. They are so soft, honestly, so soft. And then what these are is, see, I don't like, I have long arms. I'm tall, and um, I really don't like when sleeves don't cover part of my hand. I'm always pulling my sleeves down over my hand because I just, I can't, I can't handle it. If they rise up, it drives me nuts. But this is to do that. Aren't these adorable? They are such a cute addition to your outfit. I have another one coming and I think, I, I think they're black, but, um, they're so soft. Just look at that. And like I've said, I have sensory issues and I just love touching it. Like it's just so, oh, don't mind my nasty nails. I need to do my nails. I've just been crafting. Just been crafting so much. But yeah, I'm really happy that these are here. This is nice. This outfit would look better with white, but I would have totally worn this with, with this outfit if it was the right color today. I mean, these kind of three-quarter sleeves don't bother me. It's the sleeves that are supposed to hit, that are supposed to come to here that don't. That's what bothers me. That's what really bothers me. It's so bad. I get so, ugh, just so annoyed, you know? Okay. Well, I'm happy that I got those. Oh, maybe some more makeup. I've been getting a little daring. I have a lot of makeup. I have a lot of makeup because I love doing like special effects and things like that. I used to love trying to be all glam, but I don't do all that anymore. It's too much. So I was like, no, I don't really need any makeup from Timu, you know, but I've been trying it out slowly and I've been enjoying it. And so I have, this is just a liquid eyeliner pen, probably because then I don't have to use the gel. This is by Tarte. I think it's the clay pot. Um, but yeah. And it's packaged in plastic. So. That's nice. It's got one of these crazy ways to open it. I don't know if I'm going to finish this video in time for my daughter, before my daughter gets here. I am so slow. I'm so sorry. Okay. A speed of that. Oh my god. I can't get it out of the box. Looks like that. Like chocolate. I think I got brown. Ooh, this is set. Look at that. Ooh, 
that's nice. Oh my goodness, look at that. I mean, I already have... Oh, that's a mess. That's a mess. Ugh. <laughs> I'm not going to do it on my face. <laughs> Maybe when I don't have makeup on. <laughs> oh, anyway, sorry to be a tease, but... I did show you. That's a very light hand, too. I didn't press at all. I just was like, whoop, just lightly. Just real light. That's nice. Mm, this is good. I'm glad this is here. Um, I need to childproof our house. Like, we don't have toddlers of our own. So, um, this is for the fridge. Well, it's fridge and freezer, but she's not tall enough for the freezer. She likes to get in the fridge and no. <laughs> no. So, this is just to make it impossible for her to get in the fridge. She's gonna be mad. She likes to get into stuff. She is such a little spitfire. She is so adorable. She has so much spirit. I love that. I wish I had that energy though. I wish I had her energy. Oh, because she just goes, goes, goes. <gasps> I swear, I got so many things that take a minute to go through. I got, oh, that's nice. They all came individually packaged. One, two, three, four, five pieces. And this is like a hair extension that I think matches my hair the best I've ever seen on Timu. <laughs> I was so excited when I saw this color. Look at that. It's got just a little bit of the brown and a little bit of the gray. It's very, uh, very white, but I just love these. These are so fun. Oh, that's very, no, that's not a good match for my hair. <laughs> It looked closer to my hair, um, I think, in the picture. But it's so soft. Like, you know, it would blend nicely, I think. Very shiny. You need some, like, uh, dry shampoo or something. Good. It's the perfect length for my hair. It's, you know, and it's fun because it's like it adds a little highlight. A little extra pizzazz. A little extra fun. Maybe I'm just so excited to be getting gray hair that I'm trying to rush it. Because <laughs> I really do hope my hair turns gray soon. Like, more gray. I want more of it to come in. I'm just sticking that underneath so it's not as out there. Oh my god, they're so cute. What do you think? I have another wig coming too. Mm-hmm. A character wig. And I'm excited about it. And uh the character may or may not be a singing type character. I don't know. I, I don't know. I'll just leave these in. These are cute. The wig isn't coming today though. I'm I'm so sorry. <laughs> I mean it's here. It's in one of these packages. I believe this is another hair um bonnet but this is a gift for somebody so it will not be going on my head i do apologize um but it's so beautifully long for luscious long locks and it's got the elastic and it's a lovely shade of purple so yes it is a gift i like to share the things that i love with people. I mean, how much stuff can you truly get for yourself, you know? I find it way more fun buying for other people. Mmm. This will be good. I can use this while I'm filming the craft video. Oh my goodness. This is a ruler. And what I love about it is the edges. So when you are ripping paper, I don't have any paper over here. Are you kidding me? Um, it rips like that. I can't believe I don't have paper here. I don't. 
Maybe I can do it on the beans. Okay. Piece of paper. I'm going to have to do it down here so I can hold the ruler down. Gives you that old paper feel. You know, I messed this one up. Let's rip it off. It's okay. And that's the smaller one. Isn't that cool? I've always wanted one of these. And I have not gotten one until now. I think because I just didn't want to pay what they were charging for it. But, yeah. I'm excited. I'll be using that tomorrow. More crafty stuff. I got these to go, like, on bangles or even earrings. Necklace, for that matter. Little angel wings. I think it came with, like, ten. It's okay. I like those. I like it. I like it. Oh, we're getting to the end. We're getting to the end. Oh, <laughs> more childproofing stuff. This is actually just to keep their little noggins safe. <laughs> These just go on the corners of things. Um, we have a square coffee table and a chimney, like a fireplace. So I think this was one, two... One, two, three, four of them. And, oh, yes. What is this, you say? This was a spin the wheel deal, my friends. They're taking a little long getting me a new one. I want a new spin the wheel deal. Timu, if you're listening, can you bring some more my way, please? I got me some moissanite because I, I don't have enough. I like things that sparkle, and I I believe I pay, I think I paid eighty three cents for this ring, and I got it because it looks like a flower. We all know how much I love flowers. <laughs> oh my goodness, that sparkle though oh my gosh okay I gotta put it on take these off oh my god I'm so excited please fit please fit oh fits oh, look at that you're gonna see me wearing this a lot this is gorgeous I got this in a size 8 let me tell you something I know I mentioned before I'm on a weight loss journey but one of the joys of losing weight i found is my fingers are getting smaller. Which, that's why I don't have my regular wedding ring at this time. Because it's too big. <laughs> but I used to wear like an 11 on my ring finger. <laughs> Doesn't work together. Um, plus it's too big. But yeah, um... I'm going to wear that for a little while. I'm going to put this in the box. But I like that my ring size is getting smaller because it's easier to buy a ring in the smaller size. I mean, it's it's easier to find. But yeah, and it comes with a little cleaning cloth. It's uh, sterling silver as well. And it came with its little report. That's it. That's all. That's all for the haul. I hope you guys are having a fabulous morning, afternoon, evening, whatever it is, wherever you are. I hope you make it a good one, a happy one, a productive one, and a danger-free one so you don't end up in surgery. <laughs> like our son <laughs> with a broken toe. <laughs> all right, you guys. I will see you in the next one. Bye for now. Oh, <laughs>